when did you realize that hey, uh, comedy is something that I really want to pursue uh, after after maybe graduating high school? Or when did you start realizing that? Yeah, I I loved you know making people laugh、mm. as a kid. Whenever I got the chance, because、mm. I was shy,、yeah. but I would always remember things about people. If something was a weird situation, I would think, "Hmm, that's weird. That's funny." My、mm-hmm. teacher has been engaged to her boyfriend for twelve years. He still hasn't proposed. You know, things like that that I would keep in mind. And then one time, our teacher didn't come to class. She had a substitute,、mm-hmm. and one of the students in the class said,、oh, "She's getting married. That's why she's not here." And I said. They've been together twelve years. There's no way he proposed now, or something like that. And but I was a kid. We were、yeah. kids, and the, and everyone in class laughed so hard because it's such a weird, dark thing to say yeah, as a kid. As a kid, to know like he ain't proposing now. Like it's been twelve years. You know, for me to、yeah. say that. So stuff like that, I I, I loved doing, and because I、mm. loved I love listening to people. I love the human condition.、Yeah. So I knew that. But then and then I I found out about stand up comedy. When I was maybe thirteen or something, I was at、wow. church. Oh, that was early.、Mm-hmm. And someone gave me a DVD of Margaret Cho's stand-up、oh, comedy,、yeah. mm-hmm. and I went home to watch it, and I was blown away. I had never seen it before. I didn't know this was an art form,、mm-hmm. you know, or a job that you could have <laughs> one person talking for an hour <laughs> and people just watching, making people laugh, you、mm-hmm. know, and learning things at the same time. Yeah.、Uh, so I I knew I loved that, but then. It wasn't until、uh, oh, in college, you know, I I dropped out of undergrad,、mm-hmm. undergrad school,、um, and went through my first breakup ever. So I felt、mm-hmm. like I was such a loser, you know. Oh, I, my, my, like my heart was broken, my、yeah. first ever ha- heartbreak, and because of the breakup, and also I dropped out of、mm-hmm. school. I I was like, gosh, I'm just like such a failure, you、mm-hmm. know. The, But when you feel very down, that's when you try things you've always wanted to try, right? You go, "What do I have to lose? I'm already a loser. I might as well try comedy, something I've always wanted to try.、Mm-hmm. I、oh. I can't get any lower now." But、right? did you walk in in the random comedy club or? No, you took classes first. I took classes. Yeah, I took a class on the internet. I went on Craigslist. Oh yeah! Wow. Yeah. And luckily, it was an actual class. Yeah, not, yeah, not, not like an I don't know random like killer. Or I know <laughs> totally because there was the Craigslist killer. Yeah, the Craigslist killer. Yeah, was there was a whole yeah documentary. Yeah. yeah, totally, totally. I could have died <laughs> in the back of a van and just like pff, you're totally.、Gone. But you know what? At that time in America, if you're a woman doing stand up comedy, very like fewer women were doing it. Yeah. If you just showed up to a comedy club to start stand up. You could also die too, you know, or or <laughs> Why, go missing. Why was that real? Oh, come on, I think so. <laughs> or at least get harassed or something, you know. Or so, it's hard to fit in, or not even to get a spot on for open mic. Totally, and some guy will say something weird to you,、oh, or ask you out, or say something about your body, you、yeah. know. You know what I mean. Yeah, you- Either way,、rough. you were gonna be uncomfortable. So why not take a class on the internet, <laughs> <Yeah> . like <laughs> that I found on the internet. And,、yeah. And、uh, it was an all women class,、mm-hmm. so it was also like a very safe space.、Mm. And yeah, that's how I started. But also,、right. the comedy scene in Taiwan is still very young. I yeah. think yeah. it's、Seniors. not. It's not like America. You know, it's super competitive. Clubs everywhere. It's still pretty controversial、right. now in Taiwan. In、yeah. Taiwan, to people, do stand up.、Uh, I mean, the, a lot of context is sometimes it's you know it's. All kinds of it covers all kinds of topics, right? Yeah. So, so in Taiwan, I think people are just still trying to find the line of what you can make fun of and what you cannot,、mm-hmm. and what's funny or not, and should we laugh at this or shouldn't we laugh at this? Because you know,、right. Taiwan has complicated history, of course, with, yeah. You know, yeah, with China, with Japan, and even、mm-hmm. with our government, you know. So、yeah. people are like, "Oh my God, should we make fun of the person who fought for our democracy or not?" You know, stuff like that.、So、right. Like, no, I think. It's just all about that we don't really appreciate people to be too expressive in general in all culture no, compared think, to the U.S. I think Taiwanese people are so expressive. Oh yeah, yeah. I think they're. I think we're pretty expressive. <laughs> Come on, look at the, the old time TV shows. Like I mean, Zhuge Liang. Yeah, you know, that's true, it's, but yeah, it's different. I feel more at home in Taiwan than in Japan. Well, for, for、oh, sure, yeah, right? Japan, 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 Japan yeah, is more、different. like you know you gotta. Behave certain way, you know. It shouldn't. You need to fit in. Speak outside, you know. Yeah,、lying. I mean that's why comedy in Japan, I think, had a harder time being original. 
Oh, really? Yeah. But they have their like man chai. Yeah, I think Japan they have their, have their own, own form of comedy, right? For like, sure. Like but then you repeat thing. that same uh, kind of formalized. structure. Yeah. You know, true. over yeah. and over, it's the same style. Mm. Um, because in Japan, you have to go to a school to become a comedian. Uh, one oh. particular school, it's called the Yoshimoto School. Uh -huh. There's one in Osaka and there's one in Tokyo. Mm. And they're an agency too. Yeah. So it's like Taiwan, you know, if you want to become a celebrity, you go through an agency. And then yeah, so I think you're on every variety TV show. You're on every talk oh, show. Yeah, yeah, you're yeah, in yeah, commercials. Yeah. You're in movies, right? And maybe you have a career for, for many, 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 many years, yeah. right? Like… Yeah, 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 that's how it until works you're in Japan. 90 or yeah, something, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. And it's the same in Japan, but with comedy, if you want to be a comedian, you should try to be you. Sh you should you, you can't just start going to comedy clubs and become a comedian. You mm -hmm. have to go through this go through the, the, this school the, the, and okay. agency the hierarchy that you need to. And follow. because of that, there a lot of them will have sound very similar. Their perspective, oh, their see. point yeah. of view. You know, it's a lot of physical comedy, yeah. right? A lot of like. You know, um, it's not just it's not stand up comedy. You you don't talk politics at all in mm. Japanese co comedy. You mm. know, so I think um, Taiwan is actually very expressive. I was, you know, yeah, compared I, to that, yes, of course, <laughs> compared to Japan. And isn't like doesn't like Brian Singh talk politics too? And yeah. like right in his comedy and I stuff mean, like we all that? talk about politics. The thing is, uh, in Chinese. Or in Taiwanese culture, there's a saying that you, it's better to be humor if you make fun of only yourself, mm, not to mm -hmm. other people. So that's something that's still pretty mainstream that uh, people will assume that, oh, it's not funny because you're attacking other people. You're trying to make fun of other people. Then that's not good. Mm, yeah. mm. It's, so I think people are still, like I say, trying to find a line. See? Right. Was, yeah. yeah. Sure, sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 And then you can be different kinds of comedians that do different kinds of… Yeah. TV shows or yeah. talk shows. Yeah. You can be a political comedian. You just won't do maybe variety shows or yeah. something, right? You just do that. Mm. That's your own talk show on yeah. YouTube or something yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah. Also, like roasting is really new in Taiwan too. Oh, like, yeah. yeah roasting. Like, roasting, we just also… We, we've only been doing roasting for like two, three years probably. Like two oh, years. Well, About like big shows. Years. Like big shows has, has only happened for yeah. two years. So it's still a new thing. So sometimes audience… I mean, live audience love it. But if you put it on the internet, uh -huh. then people are like, oh, get are like, really, oh my god. A lot god. of people get so, really offensive. Oh my god, offensive. how can you say that <laughs> sure. kind of jokes? You know, how can you say that kind of jokes? Yeah, I don't know. What person are you? <laughs> <laughs> right? You're a monster for saying that. Yeah, I know. Oh my, you, you hurt his feelings. So he's like, no, no, yeah, they this probably know what's going on. needs to be a serial killer, killer to say that. <laughs> yeah, something like that. Wow. It's really, <laughs> yeah, so it's really new, No, this, I don't um, like roasting either. I'm not a roast comedian at all. I don't really like to make fun of other people mm. either. Mm -hmm. The only roast I did was for a Super Bowl commercial. For Mr. Peanuts? Yes. <laughs> that's why I said yes. I said roasting a cartoon character, that's perfect for me. Are you kidding me? That's so <laughs> up my alley. That's so my interest, you know? Mm. Something stupid. <laughs> I only do stupid things like that. And mm. so, yeah, roasting is hard for me too. Yeah. But the more, you know, Taiwan… Is exposed to different kinds of comedy yeah. styles, roasting, political comedy, yeah. silly comedy, physical comedy. Yeah. I just think that um, then the audience can figure out which kind of comedy yeah. they like. Yeah. Yeah. And, you know, it just expands the knowledge yeah. even more. And it also can bring more people uh, to to do comedy, right? They, they yeah. find that maybe they're good at physical comedies. They, they will come in and do it. Totally. Right? Yeah. 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 Really cool. So yeah. any reason why you came to Taiwan to do a surprise show? Yeah. Well, I, was I wasn't there. supposed it was, to. It was for free. <laughs> it was a huge hit. It was hit. for I free. Saw, oh my god! It was so fucking crowded. I was there. I was like, oh my god, I'm gonna yeah, die. Yeah, <laughs> Kylie sent me a video <laughs> saying that she could not get in. I was like, oh my god, there's a club. Like you cannot get into a comedy club. How is that possible? And it's English. For, yeah, I mean, like <laughs> That's for the thing. time, That's yeah, a hundred people got turned away. I know oh they god. couldn't get in, and. Yeah, well, why was it free? I don't have a work visa. Uh, <laughs> but also, I see. Yeah. Like volunteering work. <laughs> it's charity. <laughs> it was. I did it for the good people of Taiwan. Also, I, <laughs> I, I did it for my ego. Um, no, for my pride. No. <laughs> no be, I wasn't supposed to do a show at all. It was supposed to be vacation and oh. to come back to Taiwan. My grandma had to do some. 
uh, business in Taichung. Oh. Uh, she had to collect. Oh, so you brought your grandma again this time, right? Everyone. Okay, <laughs> but she, she had to create. She had to uh, get her like retirement money oh, <laughs> from Taichung. Ah, I see. Yeah, I, I see. I see. Uh, the government is also handing out like six thousand dollars for everyone for free who are Taiwanese. Yeah, Taiwan, who are Taiwanese. Taiwanese. Where I'm gonna tell her this. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. sure <laughs> she already knows. Oh, like, she probably she's knows. gangster. <laughs> she, <laughs> knowing her, like she collected. Bucks. She collected like three times the six thousand. Yeah. She, she'd somehow <laughs> pretended to be other people too. Who knows? <laughs> <laughs> Knowing her, you know. But so we came back for that, and um, you know, with COVID, we we were in Japan right before this, so we were like, yeah. well, Taiwan's right there, and that's. I have relatives there. I love coming. Just I love coming home to mm. my people in Taiwan and Japan. So it was just a vacation, but. You know. I thought it was like a makeup honeymoon for your husband, and then you <laughs> <laughs> start bringing your whole family again. <laughs> Kylie, oh yeah, <laughs> you think I've changed? No, <laughs> no, I'm still the same person. 